This is the Fox 11 Morning News. Welcome back, 646. Rich chocolate, plenty of sugar, and chopped nuts. <laughs> who can, re <laughs> come on, who can resist a decadent chocolate truffle like that? I didn't see that one coming. Um, so Gina Silva is live at the Blending <laughs> Lab in Mid City hey, to Gina. show us how it's done. Hi, Gina. <laughs> yes, I am. Good morning, everyone. Take a look at all of these treats. We've got the wine. We've got the chocolate. What could possibly go wrong? This is beautiful, just in time for Valentine's. But you know what? We're not just going to have you salivate over these delicious treats. We're going to show you how to make French truffles. And for that, I bring in chocolatier Garrett Anderson, who, by the way, take a look at this. He is 6'8". <laughs> I am so short, and you are so tall. Short and sweet. Yes. Short and sweet. All right, come on over. Now, he, I refer to him as the most interesting man in the world. I have to stand on a box here. Because he's not just a chocolatier. He's a beekeeper, an opera singer, an urban chicken farmer. Urban chicken farmer. And he yeah. owns his own cacao plantation in Ecuador. In Ecuador, yes. Yeah, you're, it sounds like you have a little bit of an accent there. Are, I'm from Mexico. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so show us what we're going to do. Okay, so we're, this is What Do You Love Chocolate. This is available at the Blending Lab Winery here in Los Angeles, and it's 75% dark chocolate. And what's really unique about our chocolate is that most of the time when you have a dark chocolate like that, it leaves it a bitter and astringent taste in your mouth. This is very fruit forward and very delicious. Most people don't even know that they're eating dark chocolate. And healthier. And healthier. It's supposed to be healthy for you. Yes. All yes. Right. So do you want to try it? Yes. Okay, well, here. Go ahead. What, what are we, how do okay. we make it? Okay. I know our viewers so, want to know. Okay. How do we make, so here, there's two different things here. This is our bar. What do you Forgive, love? What do you love bar? And the reason for that is that we talk about what do you love about your life? Like what, what do you love about your life? And I think that when people concentrate on what they love about their life, that blossoms. It's just like our chocolate. Just like the chocolate. Just like our chocolate. Okay. So what we have here is truffles, and we'll tell you how to make truffles. And these are authentic tr French truffles, unlike the bonbons that you see here in candy stores a lot. Right, right. And then this is a bar. So if you'd mm -hmm. want to try that, please okay. do so. And um, mm, delicious. Definitely not bitter. No, it's really good, and it's seventy-five percent. Very, very. Yeah, good. it goes okay. really good with wine. This so, is a blend. The blend. Yeah. All right. So how do you make the truffles? What do we do? Okay. So you start off, what I do is I take these and I just break them up into the pan here. And we have a hot plate here that, that is portable. And then what we do is we take uh, cream, heavy cream, and we put it in there like that. It heats up for how long? It heats up, well you don't want the milk to burn. So you want the milk to be really hot and then you let it cool as you're stirring it. Okay. So then you just stir it together. You add a half a teaspoon of vanilla, which is just, you know, I just use a little bit of the cap. And then you stir it and you let it cool. And then that comes down to this. Actually, this is what it ends up with. So this, How long does it take, roughly? Um, well, to cool, you want to cool it in the refrigerator for maybe a couple of hours. And in, on the stove? On the stove, maybe 20 minutes. 20 minutes. Yeah. And you keep stirring. Make sure really, it doesn't burn. Yeah, Yeah, exactly. But really, really easy to make. And you can take these classes here as well at the Blending Lab, and they've got the wine, and you can sign up online. Yes, at ifonly.com, and uh, look for the truffle class on uh, ifonly.com. All right. Truffles and wine. Sounds good to me. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> and I don't even drink wine, but it sounds good to me. <laughs> what, please bring it this way. Uh, Roxia, yeah, I, I know you have to be here because you love the wine. I, <laughs> I know a person or two here uh, at this on this set who does. Thank you, Gina. You definitely enjoy it, and I'm not one of the... You oh, you're not one of the two? I'm not one of the two. What are you talking about? You know what? Don't, there's no shame in our wine game, Roxanne. <laughs> we love it. No. Gina, Gina will teach you how to drink that.